there is no losing in life either you win or you learn hello everyone today i'm going to show you how to create less than o give or a frequency curve now we have class and frequency same as same as previous one i choose the same data and for this we will need less than o give class and less than less than cf for less than class we will not be using zero five we should use upper class values that is five ten to continue this same style we can directly select these two cells at first now as soon as this mm, plus small thin plus sign appears we can drag it downward and we can see that we have 35 at the end which is correct now for less than cf we need less than 5 less than 5 is 4 equals to click on the frequency of 0 to 5 plus enter and for the frequency of less than 10 means 4 plus 3 or 4 plus 3 that is equals to d5 plus d3 it's we should use d3 so that it would be easier for us to continue the same for another lower value of cf click on enter now we can select on this and when the plus sign thin plus sign appears we can drag it now we can check the formula if it is correct or not for less than frequency curve calculation less than cf we need it to be equal with n at the end it is equal so it's correct and we can see the changes in formula d6 plus d7 for 10 to 15 which means d6 is 7 plus b7 b7 is 7 it means 14 plus 7 23 wait 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 d6 7 plus 7 equals to 14 14 plus 9 okay it's correct now what we have to do is we have to tabulate it this is not necessary step it is just to make it more presentable now for the actual less than ogim or the less than frequency curve we need to select less than class select it leave it then click on control from the keyboard and again select the cf less than cf now click on insert scatter scatter with straight lines and marker Select the desired style, desired layout, delete the series, delete these lines. Now you have to change the chart title by clicking on it. Again, click on it and delete it. And do the same for axis titles. Now you can see that I have made changes to the title now drag it to the desired location and resize it it's done don't forget to say thank you